Hey guys, what's up? It's Pseudo Pluto here, and I'm going to be doing an unboxing and overview of the XP Pen Deco 01. Um, this is the V2 version, and uh, just as a disclaimer, I got this as a gift, so I did not pay for it. Um, I got it from my company, the internet, so um, let's get into it. So I think it just slides out at the top here. <laughs> I've really got to find out how to do these one-handed. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put this down and get this off. Okay, we got that part off, and so now this is just the main box. Take it like this from here. Cool, and we got like a little fox up here. Let's see if that can focus. Yeah, and I think yeah. So this looks like to be a screen protector. Uh, looks like it is helpful that they included. Uh, yep. And here's the actual tablet. Let's see how I can pull this out. Yeah. So this is great. See, this is actually pretty much the size of my actual display. Um, this was the drawing tablet that I used before. It's much bigger. Um, and so there should be like a better ratio from like drawing tablet to actual um, output on the screen. So it should be like less finicky, less jittery, because I can do like larger mo like movements um, compared to my old smaller one. So here's the tablet, very thin. Um, got the stylus. It feels like a pen. <laughs> The booklet and the cable, and I think this is a pen, uh, a stand for the pen. Yeah. Cool. So I'm gonna go get this set up, and then yeah, I guess I'll do like the rest of the overview. Okay, so I plugged in the drawing tablet into my computer, um, and I thought I would, you know, uh, give it a test here in my paint. Um, I also have credit installed, but I think. Uh, my paint is like the, the pretty easy one to show it off in. So I think one of the selling points for this tablet was um, the tilt. So here I have the marker fat and you see um, there's a little arrow that, that means it's a tilt brush. So if I do the brush um, pointing straight up, it makes a straight line, right? But if I go on the side, you know, like I'm shading in something, see it's much fatter and that's with like um, not the same amount of pressure, right? Right, and then if we go from top again, right? Top, it's like a normal marker. Side, you know, I can... Um, it's fatter without having to, you know, like apply more pressure, right? If I apply more pressure here, it just makes it darker, right? But if I go to the side, I can make it wider using that tilt function, you know, and make it wider without having to like apply more pressure. So the tilt does work out of the box on Linux, which is which is great. Um, and yeah, I, I've actually recorded this this part um, a bit after the unboxing, so I used it for a couple of my homeworks. And um, let's go to the one that I always use, uh, new canvas. Yeah. So honestly. Let's change the color because blue is weird. Uh, how do I change again? Uh, color, change color. And then let's just make that black. Yeah. Cool. And new canvas. Yeah, so I actually don't use my paint that often. Um, maybe, I don't know, maybe we, maybe we can do a series where I learn like digital drawing in my paint or crypto. But I mainly use um, this application called X Urinal plus plus, right? And um, that allows me to like draw in PDFs. So I, I, I mainly just like um, write like math equations, right? On PDFs, like using this drawing tablet. And actually, let me think. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna show up my homework. Um, maybe next semester where I won't get in trouble. But yeah, overall it's been it's been pretty good. The the, the added real estate, right? Um, if I go from one end of the screen to the other, 
like that's huge that's like the width of like my laptop um so that means i can like really go close in you know and be like obviously i have to like um uh make make a finer tip of the pen let's see where i can change that settings size Um, opaque, let's max that out. Why it's, hmm. why it's so hard to do this. Pigment, 100%. Size, what happens if I reduce size? Huh, okay. Uh, I'll mess around with that later. But yeah, um, I'm able to, you know, like use a lot more space and like draw um, a lot more concentrated, you know? Um, with my old drawing tile, if you saw, it's like pretty tiny, right? So I couldn't really, you know, like write accurately. Um, I'll just write out my name without, you know, like having to like do like micro adjustments, right? And so my handwriting was a lot messier. Um, my hand cramped a lot. And so just having this bigger tablet, you know, um, really helps me out when I'm doing homework. Um, I think another feature is that I can actually like rotate the tablet and basically it becomes like an um, A4 piece of paper. I can right on like the pdf like one to one and that's that's pretty amazing so um yeah i'm pretty happy with the drawing tablet obviously it was free so <laughs> like <laughs> i i don't know how i would say it's like money worth but um just as like a free gift i've been pretty impressed with it um uh, let me know if i should learn digital drawing so i can get like more like nuanced review of the tablet um I've, I've been thinking of like going through like the crypto docs and, and learning how to draw or paint, but, but for my purposes, which is like homeworks, right? Let's, let's do like some autonomy, right? Uh, a to B, right? And we can go to C and let's just do like, um, A, B, right? And then if we go back to B, and it can go back to B. Otherwise, if we get um, any, we go back to C. Yeah, so like doing like that, or I, I think I even used it once for, for, for an internship interview, right? Where they asked me to like whiteboard some code and I was, you know, able to say, okay, um, some um, every other, right? And we're give it an array like one, two, three and let's do four and we want to sum every other so we want to do the sum of that so we can do you know like um four i um and i equals zero i is less than r dot size right like, like you get the gist right it's it's, it's very nice for for doing my CS homework, um, I, sorry, I can't really give it like a nuanced um, review for like drawing. Um, but yeah, um, hopefully you enjoy like this unboxing and like my, my thoughts on this.